Now, here is the beauty of Arabic. In fact, one letter or one word can mean so many things. Like the word li. Li can mean the following. For, on behalf of, in favor of, because of, for the sake of, due to, owing to, for the purpose of. That's the word li. Or the, when li is added to, to the word in front. At the time of, when, etc. And la, the sound la, would mean truly, readily, certainly, surely. And you see there's just a change in the sound structure. Other words which show, uh, that show relationships or connection between two things will be ala, meaning on or towards or upon. These will be your prepositions. Uh, two, four, on top of. You will have ila, meaning towards, upon, two, as far as, till, until. Then fi, we mean in, at, depending on the structure of the sentence, or near. And min will be of, hatta will be until, or till. And ma'a will be with, an will be of or away from, or as declared of, qada will be already, may. These are just the meanings, some of the meanings. Mindu, mundu will mean since. At lada will be at or by or in presence of. So you see the variations of the meanings.